Hey everybody, it's your friendly neighborhood hangar robin here. Welcome aboard the Turan 2, Break 2, Battle Written 2.0, for the Italianos. And just remember, whatever you see here, you could probably do better because, yeah, you have a tank being drove by a hobbit who wears tri-vocals. So, yeah, I am just hoping to see the bad guys. If I kill a few bad guys, I'll be happy. Oh, hello there. Oh, there went your driver. You're not too happy. Yeah, let's... You want to play? We can play. Ah, uh, T want... How did I just hit... What? Okay, how am I hitting a tank I cannot even see? Three times I hit the tank I cannot even see. Thank you. Oh, good grief. Uh, one thing you will see with this tank is a buttload of T-126s and T-80s. But hey, yes, there you go. Get up there, my big fat French friend. Yes, you will make good spaced armor. Yeah, I've got my little have you angle today on the back, but I have learned that with this tank, no, don't angle. It has the same problem as the Tiger P. Yeah, it's got a little flat plate on the side, so don't angle it. Just go straight on. The armor actually isn't too bad. Uh, would you pop with the smoke in the poppings? Uh, yeah, you get smoke on this one. Don't ever use the smoke. It's completely pointless. Okay, so there was that guy. How did I hit him from the... I don't know. Did I have the magic bullet of heat rounds? Yeah, you also get AP with this thing. But yeah, don't bother with the AP. It's, it's okay. I mean, it might kill a light talk, but yeah, I'd rather just sling the heat. Because as you see, the heat works quite nicely. Oh, uh, bombs already? This match hasn't even been going two minutes. Oh, uh, good grief. Guys, you really need to put a timer on the cast birds, because... Someone should not be able to get enough points to break out cast less than three minutes in. This is ridiculous. I mean, seriously. Okay, what we got up here? We got us one of them little British things. We got an American thing. And more bombs? Really? Really? Good. Was that a rocket? What the hell was that? Oh, good grief. Now we got rocket tongs? Oh, hello there. Oh, I bet that did not feel good, did it, friend? Well, let me give you another one then. Eh, well, at least it's barrel busted. That's a positive. Would you die, please? Thank you. One thing you will love about this talk is the reload. And more bombs! Yay. Because, yeah, people should be totally able to get cast three minutes into a match with enough cast that you can triple bomb. Oh, good grief, guys. Now, I took this thing out for three matches, and the other two matches, he... I didn't even get scratched, because, yeah, I got one or two kills. Unfortunately, I went to the left, thinking everybody was going to go to the left, and no, everybody went to the right. Well... That's what happens when you have a blind talker who does not do the talks much. Okay, what the hell is that? Uh, get... Really? Really, Gaijin? That is four cast birds in three minutes. I am sorry, but this is getting ridiculous. This is silly. This is just bloody silly. Is that another rocket? Where is with all the rockets? Uh, yep. And magical arties. Yay, wonderful. Well, let's see if this thing is any good as the cast bird. I just baited that for a sub request, so heck, why not? And good lord, we're going to have to do something about all these damn birds in the sky. This is getting ridiculous. This is absolutely batshit. Uh, at least we got a F4, F4, if you will please go over there and shoot the planes, that would be useful. Hello, F4. F4, we have multiple planes up. Hello. 
What are you? And he's going back to base. Yay! You ever have one of them teams where, where every time you think, you know, surely they can't be that stupid. They're like, no, hold my beer. I will show you how stupid we can get. Good bloody grief. Come on, guys. I mean, seriously, with this much cast, you're going to have to shoot some things down now. You got freaking American 50 cows. Why are you not shooting them? Good grief. Half of the tanks here have got American 50 cows on them. What the hell is this? Is it going away? Is it going... I can't tell. Oh, I am a pilot. I am not the tonker. Good grief. I am a pilot, Jim. Not a freaking dirt slinger. Oh, I hear something. It's a damn stuka. Where the stuka? Oh, hello? Mr. Loudass Stuka? Nope, can't see him. Ooh, but there's something fat. You come here, fat boy. How would you like a big derp gun? Oh, that works. I will take that. Heck yes. Okay. All right, I see where you're going. You want it down the slot. Oh, but at this angle, I'm not going to be able to hit squat. Oh, I hear somebody got a bofers. Anything down there? Hello. Hello. Uh, I have to say, so far though, playing with the Turan 2, it actually reminds me a lot of a Panzer 3. Excuse you, that was rude. Damn Stukas. How many damn casts do they have friggin' up? This is ridiculous. Hello, stupid friggin' anti-cast thing. Would you please shoot the planes? Oh, good lord, you got 450 cows. Why are you not shooting all the planes? Oh, seriously? Good grief, dude. There's like eight planes up. Why have you not shot them all down? Oh, it's, this team is just sad. This team is making me sad. Oh, gotta try to dodge. Oh, and of course not, because there's yet another Casper. Let's see, we got Stuka IL-2. Friggin' at least two lags. Uh, come on, guys. Good grief. How many planes do we have up and you haven't shot anything? Uh, you know, sometimes you just have to do all the work. I mean, what else can you do? That's why I put this thing in here as anti-cast. Because, yeah, people underestimate the little CR-32Bs. But I am damn glad I picked this up for three bucks in the freaking war bonds. No, it wasn't the war bonds, was it? It was in the market. Yeah, they dumped it in the market super cheap one time. So, yeah, I picked one up. The difference between this and the CR-42? DACA! That's more DACA! Yeah, you get two extra MGs, which, believe me, for casts and anti-casts, it helps. It really does. Okay, and of course our F-4 is getting his ass handed to him, because why the hell wouldn't he? Uh, our P-40 is doing jack with a side of diddle, and our CR-21, who the hell even knows? I just give up on figuring what he's trying to do. He hasn't done much. Hello there! How are you doing? Yeah, I kind of think you needed that piece. Oh, the agility on this thing is so nice. Alright, come here. Oh, I'll take it. I will take that and be most happy. All right, see, this is one thing I have learned about being a Tonker. You have to control the skies. Think of it like Germany in 1943. Yeah, if you don't control the sky, you're not doing much on the ground. So we are going to have to get in here, and we are going to have to protect our little friends down there, even if they aren't the smartest of peoples, so that they can actually get over here and do some work. Is there anything open top here? No, no, excuse you. Low bridge coming through. Oh, good grief. It's bad enough I have to watch out for the bad guys. Oh, speaking of bad guys. Hello, bad guy. How are you? Oh, that's a crit. That, that didn't feel too good. All right, come here, kitty, 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 kitty. Here you go. Would you like some buff 50 cows? Yes. Look at the wing come clean off. Oh, I have to say I love the Italian 50 buff. 
Okay, what's next? You can't tell me all them cast birds just magically disappeared. No. I'm smelling more bad guys. Oh, Lord, look at all the smoke. Yep, and here they come. I see one. I see two. What the hell is that? Okay, that is an I-29. Who in the hell brings a $300 freaking market bird? What the hell is... And a lagater, because yes, why not? Yeah, what now? Now what's behind me? Good freaking grief. Sky pattern's full. The pattern is full. Oh, what kind of idiot, though, brings an I-29? It's not even a good cast bird. It doesn't get rockets, it doesn't get booms, and its 20's not that good at penny. It's just stupid. I'm just surrounded by stupid. Oh, I, are you really going to try to turn fight me? Really? Do you honestly think a twin engine heavy is going to outturn a biplane? No, that is not going to work. Hello there. Nope, you can't do this. No, you can't, but I can. Oh, there's some more smacks. And Toro, round and round we go. Swing it around. Here we go. Hello there, Mr. $300 Premium. Now you are great. I hope that teaches you a valuable lesson. Quit doing this stupidity. All right, now where's Laggy Derp? Laggy Derp. Hello, Laggy Derp. Would you come here, please, Mr. Laggy Derp? Oh, don't think about it. Don't you do it. Yeah, I know these 50s like the back of my hand. That, no. That was not a smart idea. All right, now where's that damn Laggy Derps? Oh, there you are. Hello, Laggy Derps. There we go. Oh, I busted up your water cooler pretty good, didn't I? Would you come here? Hello? To the map. Hello? Don't you want to play? Uh, is he going back to base? Yeah, now that he can't friggin' 2v1 a biplane, yeah, I, I think his bravery is just kind of left. So I'm going to put a little cut around here because with my wing busted, yeah, I need to go back to base. And I don't see anything else to kill. I mean, look at all the smoke. I think everything is pretty much dead by now. So I'm just going to wish everyone a GG. Because good Lord, that took some work. But hey, you got to do what you got to do sometimes. And it shows that if you clear out the planes, yeah, your team can actually get some work done. Good grief, we went from triple cap to friggin' triple capping. Yeah, that's a hell of a turnaround, I got to say. All right, come on, get my little baby down. There we go. Do not want to damage my beautiful pasta delivery bird. Thank you. And come on. Eh, four air, three ground. Yeah, 2,600 RP, not bad. And let's see how this little run paid. Come on, Gaijin. Come on. I know you can do it. I know you're buggy as hell, but come on. You can do it. Come on. Here we go. Eh, not bad. Not bad at all. So what do I think of the little Turon 2? For a first price, it's pretty good. I, I think it's about like a Panzer 3N. I mean, it's got a little faster fire rate than the Panzer 3N. But its armor isn't quite as good as the Panzer 3N. So, yeah, I would say, yeah, pretty close to the middle of the Panzer 3N territory. Great fire rate, though. Three and a half second reload. Hell, yeah. I would say this is better than the Hedgehog, but not as good as that freaking 40 millimeter fridge thing. But, yeah, for a first prize, hell, yeah. I would strongly suggest, though, if you haven't picked up the Soleri Sahariano in the War Bonds, since it's in there this time, go ahead and pick that up. Because in the three matches I run, this thing only sees 2.7 BR, which means the Solari makes a damn good backup for this thing. So you will have you a decent low-tier Italian lineup. Well, I hope you're having fun with your battle pass, and I hope to see you 
up there in the clouds. Have a good one, y'all.